Well, today's date is uh, 17th August 2021. My name is Julfikar Stein Chaudhary and I'm going to conduct our speaking test. In this first part of the test, I'm going to ask you some questions about yourself. Can you first tell me your full name? My full name is Priya Chaudhary, as you can see me in my passport. Uh, what name shall I call you, Priya? You may address me as Priya. Okay, Priya, where are you from? I live in uh, Rangdia, which is a small pujula between uh, Sujagam and Rangamati. It's a beautiful village to live. Um, why is Gangunia famous for? Well, there is a paper mill called Kamsili Paper Mill. It is, uh, this area is famous for bees uh, because uh, in uh, the paper for used for government purposes like golden color paper uh, is first made in this paper mill. So that's why Rangani is very famous for this paper mill. As well as uh, Rangani is famous for uh, their Sir Kotha to be repetition. Okay, sir. So, uh, firstly, Rangunia is very famous for a paper mill called Kormakuli paper mill because uh, the golden color paper uh, first made from this uh, paper mill. That's why it is very famous for this. Secondly, uh, Rangunia is famous for a sweet called uh, uh, Rashgul, uh, uh, called Rashgulla. Uh, it is made. It is made with secret dish uh, in Rangunia Shantinikatan. It is also very famous for. Uh, how how do you travel to the town or city from your hometown? Well, I travel to the city from my hometown or by bus. Sometimes I pray for auto rickshaw. This that's it. What is the most challenging part in living in your neighborhood? Well, the most challenging part is that uh, this is not a clean area. People don't want to uh, people don't want to put their garbage at dustbin. So the waste management system was very bad in my neighborhood. So I I don't uh, I find it uh, I find it challenging. All right. Um, what is the main source of living in your hometown? Sorry, sir. What is the main source of livelihood among the people in your hometown? Well, in my hometown, people uh, uh, people uh, people live on different kind of uh, job sectors. Like uh, you can find here farmers, even uh, government officers also. Uh, well, in my uh, hometown, there are uh, there are several banks, so people. Work in the uh, work in the bank also, but uh, there is also uh, hospitals uh, like five general hospital and two private clinics. So people uh, work uh, as a health ser uh, health service. Uh, people work as health service also. Okay, thank you very much. Um, now I'm going to give you a card. On the card, you'll find a topic, and you'll also find some guiding questions. Based on that, you'll have to prepare a talk for one to two minutes, and you have one minute time to take notes. Your topic is to describe an interesting song. Your time begins now. Don't worry if I stop you after one minute. Okay.
Okay, would you like to start now? Yes, sir. Well, I have heard different kinds of songs, but today I would like to share about a song which uh, encourages me a lot. Uh, when I was in class nine, uh, I had to I had to participate in the cultural program related to 21st uh, February, which is famous for International Mother Language Day. So I was searching for a song which uh, suited. Uh, th that function most. Uh, for that, uh, I uh, I was searching uh, song uh, in TV programs or in cassettes. So I found a song telecasted on the Bangladesh television. Uh, it was really interesting because it was about uh, it, it was about uh, the. Uh, mm, it was about the country's love. It is a patriotic song. Uh, it was uh, dedicated. It is dedicated to those who given who have given their life for uh, for our mother tongue. So I uh, I listened. Uh, I heard this. Uh, I heard this song fully and understand. I understood all lyrics. Then I gave it to. <clears throat> Some of the points I didn't understand, so I took the notes and uh, gave this to my mom. Uh, he, she really helped me to understand all that point. Basically, I didn't know about all history about about our uh, language uh, language procession. So she helped me to know the history of our country and to relate this song with the real situation. Uh, I'm proud of that fact that yes, uh, our uh, our so song maker can um, can make this uh, real uh, can make this uh, can make this real to uh, relate with the situation with the song. So you can feel uh, the real uh, patriotism uh, by hearing this song. Uh, and also, I found this song very interesting because it was about uh, those. Martyrs, uh, those soldiers who really cared for our country, who uh, were uh, who who were students at that time, and they gave their life without any hesitation. That was uh, that was um, that that inspired me a lot uh, because they loved their country, and we have to love our country also. So from this song, I have learned many things. I get to know about my country, about my country's history, and um, to um, relate okay. uh, to relate uh, the history with the situation. Thank you very much. Do you like music? Sorry, sir. Do you like music? Hello, sir. Do you like music? Sorry, oh, sorry, I was mute. I was mute, sorry. Do you like music? Yes, I do. Music is a, a music is a daily part of my life. life. Okay. What kind of music do you like? Well, I like different kind of music, uh, like patriotic, um, patriotic music, and sometimes I prefer to hear uh, instrumental musical so but i like most uh, the uh, i like most the classical music when do you usually listen to music well whenever i get free time i prefer to listen to music but most of the time when i go for somewhere and i put my headphone in my ear and i listen to music what kind of music is popular in your country? In my country, in, in my country, the uh, remix music is getting very popular nowadays uh, because young generation are very uh, addicted from this song. Like uh, in this song, uh, they use different kind of beats so that uh, so that so that uh, so that uh, the young generation get uh, enthusiasm for dancing as well as for singing. So it is getting popular in my country. Um, do you wish? Do you wish you could play me any musical instrument? Sorry, sir. Do you wish you could play musical instrument? 
Yes, yeah, basically, I know how I know uh, how to play various instruments. Like I, I play how to play. Uh, I know how to play harmonium and guitar and also as well as uh, keyboard. Uh, that means piano. And I know how to use tabla and uh, mandolin. So I'm good at it. Okay. Which is your favorite instrument? Well, among this instrument, I. I prefer, I prefer to use basically mandolin and tabla because it gives me uh, it, it it gives me the feel of to uh, to uh, it gives me the feel to dance with the beat. So I can uh, make chords or the uh, beat. That's why I love that uh, instrument very much. Thank you very much. This is the end of your.